Siamese native to Thailand. The Siamese cat is a natural breed. It has been genetically mutated to create a pointed pattern on its feet, offsetting the lighter color of its body and legs. In Thailand, the Siamese cat is known as Wichin Mat, which translates to Moon Diamond. By the 1900s, the Siamese became an extremely popular breed in the Western world. Thanks to their playful attitudes, higher than average intelligence and social attitudes, these cats often live up to 10 years, but some cats live to be 12 years. Egyptian Mo Cats in the Egyptian Mo family generally have short hair that is marked by dark spots, since they are one of the rare breeds of cats that don't natural spots. They are highly coveted in the Western world. These pets are also known to have sing-song voices and often sound like they are gargling or singing when they meow. This breed was created in Italy in the 1950s, thanks to the Princess Natalie of Russia began collecting various species from Egypt. The Egyptian Mo is also one of the quickest cats and usually land on their feet. Selkirk Rex These little balls of fur are distinct because of their curly hair. Selkirk Rex cats come in both long and short hair varieties. This unusual-looking cat was first bred in Montana in the 1980s and made popular on the TV show, Moonlighting. These breeds vary in personality and can be cuddly, laid-back or playful. When improperly bred, the Selkirk Rex can have kinked tear ducts that result in tears running down the cat's face almost consistently. Norwegian Forest Cat This long-haired cat is popular thanks to its long, glossy coat. Historians believe that Vikings introduced this cat to Norway around 1000 AD. The Norwegian forest cat almost became extinct back in World War II, but efforts put into place by the Norwegian Forest Cat Club kept the breed alive. The cat comes in a variety of colors, including black and white and brown and white. These cats are known to be extremely quiet, but become louder when dogs are around. They are very sociable and need constant attention. American Shorthair The American Shorthair is said to be the seventh most popular cat in the United States according to Cat Financiers Association. Its origins are thought to have begun in Europe. Historians believe these cats were brought to the United States in order to protect valuable cargo from mice and other pests. These cats are known for their pinched faces and short hair. The American Shorthair has a powerful build and is very muscular. They are also known to be very agreeable pets and are extremely affectionate with their owners. Corwit Though corets are relatively small, they are extremely strong and heavy. They are marked by their dark gray hair and heart-shaped eyes that are always green. Corets are extremely loving animals and are considered to be good luck. Surprisingly, most of these cats weren't sold to private owners, only given as gifts. Originally called the Blue Siamese in the Western world, the Cora showed up in Britain in the 1800s. The first appeared in the Cat Book Poems in Thailand. Siberian Siberians are known as being one of the largest cats to be domesticated. They have powerful bodies and large chests. Their ears are medium to large. The full name of this breed is the Siberian Forest Cat. Hailing from Russia, they might be the breed that all other long-haired breeds hailed from. These cats are known to be extremely loyal and long-time companions. Since their fur is so long, these cats must be groomed and cleaned often to ensure their fur does not matter tangle. O.C. Cat Another cat with natural spots, the O.C. Cat is domesticated yet looks wild. Domestically bred, these cats were first bred in the United States. Most cats in this breed are extremely sociable and are not shy to approach strangers. Some of these cats have dog-like personalities and perform tricks in a similar way to dogs, like fetching and walking on a leash. Many owners even report that their O.C. cat will play in the water. British Shorthair Similar in appearance to the American Shorthair, the British Shorthair is recognizable by its dark grey coat and short fur. The main differentiation is its chunky body. 
Unlike the American Shorthair, which is lean and muscular, the British Shorthair has rolls of skin. These cats are descendant of Egyptian cats and were popularized by Alice in Wonderland through the role of the Cheshire Cat. Though traditionally grey, British Shorthairs are available in many colors, including black and brown. They are very sweet but dignified and are usually kept as indoor cats only. Ragdoll Ragdoll cats have long, fluffy hair and are known for their distinctive piercing blue eyes. These cats are descendant from Persian and Angora cats and were first bred in the 1960s. They come in a variety of colors, including brown and white and black and white. Substantially large cats, some males, can weigh in at 20 pounds. The name Ragdoll was created in the 1970s. Ragdolls are very personable and another breed that resembles dogs. They often follow their owners around, seeking attention. Some even believe that the ragdoll is resistant to pain. American Curl The most distinctive feature on the American Curl is the short ears that curl away from the face, giving this breed its name. American Curls first made an appearance in the 1980s. Supposedly, they showed up on doorsteps in California. These are medium-sized cats that are not bred too closely to any other relatives, so they often live long lives and are relatively healthy. They are known for loving people and have very gentle personalities, which makes this cat a great gift for children. Scottish Fold Cat These cats have short fur and look somewhat similar to American short hairs and British short hairs. Their most distinctive feature is their short ears that fold over. They have large eyes and are often grey in color. Originating in Scotland in 1961, these cats all come from one common ancestor named Susie. They are known for being extremely outgoing. They are also quite clever, and many Scottish folds are known for teaching themselves how to open cabinets and knock over items, so be sure to train Scottish folds early. Sphinx one of the most visually striking cats on the list, the Sphinx appears to have no hair, so these cats are great for anyone with allergy issues. Though they look bald, they don a down coat. Popularized by Dr. Evil in the movie, Austin Powers, Sphinx have pointy ears and come in a variety of colors. Their skin tends to have a loose look to it. Sphinx are known to be very healthy. But certain health problems may arise, including respiratory issues. These cats, though they may not look very cuddly, are extremely friendly and love to love their owners. American Wire Hair Mutated from the American Short Hair, the American Wire Hair has many physical attributes to its recent ancestor. These cats are strong, sturdy animals that have almond-shaped eyes. Their most distinctive feature is their wiry hair that is short and springs to the touch. Though some of these cats would do well as outdoor cats, most enjoy the indoors. They are known to be very playful animals and love to be pet. They also make great lap cats. Russian Blue Cat Although this cat is called the Russian Blue, the breed has no blue in its fur. Russian Blues often come in colors that range from dark gray to black. Though they are shy around strangers, they are known to be very sociable animals. Also called Archangel Blues, these cats hail from Russia but were brought to the British Isles in the 1800s. Most Russian Blues have green eyes, which pop against their monochromatic fur. They are known to be extremely cuddly. The Peter Bald Like the Sphinx, the Peter Bald is an extremely short-haired cat. Though they hail from Russia, they more closely resemble oriental cats than other Russian ones. Though most are born bald, some are born with small tufts of fur that they eventually lose. These cats make great pets to children because they are extremely friendly and loyal. They have almond-shaped eyes and come in a variety of colors, including pink and gray. They love tricks and attention and will do almost anything to please their owners. Persian. These large, fluffy balls of fur have short, round faces. They have long hair that comes in a variety of colors. They probably originated in Persia in the 1600s. First shown at a cat show in the 1800s, the Persian has long since been a popular cat. They have sweet personalities and are extremely quiet. 
they love quiet lifestyles and homes. So while little children often love Persians, they do better with an older crowd. Health issues include respiratory issues and heart conditions. The Bengal Crossbred between domestic and feral jungle cats, the Bengal has strange spotted markings. Created in the 1970s by Dr. William Centerwall, Bengal cats have since become domesticated. Cats can be long or short-haired. They range in size. Female Bengals are relatively small, where male Bengal cats can grow as large as a medium-sized dog. These cats are not great for small children since they can be temperamental. Bengals love swimming and climbing, so they integrate into areas that have access to outdoor spaces. The Savannah, one of the priciest cats on the list, the Savannah is bred between domestic and feral species. This species come in sizes both large and small. The smallest savannas are around 7 pounds, while the largest ones weigh in around 25 pounds. They have exotic, distinct spots that make them appear even more feral. Like the Bengal, the savannah loves to play outside and needs tons of attention. These cats came on the scene in the 1980s and have been popular ever since. Since these are short-haired cats, they are easy to care for and maintain. Your own cat. Your cat is your best fuzzy friend, alarm clock, and one true companion who will hang out with you while you're in the bathroom. Your cat might not have cost you as much as the feral jungle the savannah cat, but you wouldn't trade your baby for anything in the world. You know the best part of you and your cat. You decided to adopt. Adopting a cat not only means you save hundreds of dollars, but you also save them from a dangerous street life and potential euthanasia. Adopting your kitty from a shelter is spiritually rewarding, knowing that you've saved a life and given them a loving home.